Congratulations, you two. Thank you. John and Phyllis Cook were the talk of the Kingston residents in Sylvania on Thursday. That was the happy couple. <laughs> there we go. The two had been dating for about a year when they went to get their marriage license on Wednesday. They ended up just having their wedding right there. Wasn't a plan, but we got there and, and they said, well, we could marry you here. And I said, well, good, let's get it over with. <laughs> the two lovebirds each lost two spouses. John is a World War II veteran that recently turned 100 years old. Phyllis, originally from West Virginia, will turn 103 on August 8th, which is still three years shy of how old her mother lived to be. Their relationship blossomed over the past months, and as a devout Christian woman, Phyllis decided it was best to tie the knot. Tell you the truth, we fell in love with each other. I know you think that may be a little bit far-fetched for somebody our age, but we fell in love with each other. Well, we just were compatible in, in a lot of ways and found ourselves, you know, enjoying each other's company. And the cooks spend their days with each other in the assisted living facility, enjoying eating meals and sitting out in the sun. Despite spending hours together every day, they understand the importance of their space. What we do, we kept both of our apartments. He's upstairs and I'm down. Their age is certainly not a factor in the romance. There is still a big spark when they spend time with one another. I asked John what their favorite thing to do together was. His response? Well, I probably shouldn't talk about that. 